Welcome back to Scrapping with Cynthia. Hey guys, I hope you're having a good day. Uh, this video is just something random that I put together. I'm going to be changing out the curtains in my bedroom. These curtains I got from JCPenney's years ago. And as you can see, they are still pretty and still in really good shape. And it has like this little uh, reflective gold in them, but they're, they're tan with a little reflective gold. Um, so what I'm going to be doing is going with something a little bit more lighter. So I chose these curtains, and they do have a subtle gold strip going through those. And these curtains do have a liner have a white backing on them okay. now I've already taken down my old curtains as you can see so I'm gonna be putting up the new ones and this time I'm only gonna use um, I'm gonna use less curtains and we'll see how that looks. And if it looks crazy, of course, I'll go ahead and purchase some more. But for right now, I want it to be really airy and really light. And then we have this side. did I really think I was going to get away with not doing any work these curtains are 84 inches and of course my window the way I have my rod hanging up there uh, I think it it measures out to be like um, 86 or something like that or 87 which is an odd number for curtains so um, I have two choices. I'm either going to let that hem down in that curtain or I am going to move the rod down. So that's what my issue is. And as you can see, that hem will give me at least two more inches. Did get those curtains to kiss the floor almost. Uh, so I took the hem out as you can see they're pretty sheer at the bottom, but that's fine It just don't have that backing on it and Then of course the top part I moved the rod down uh, about one inch Now, of course, I didn't have any problem on this side. The curtain is all the way down to the floor, which is excellent. But I like this. I'm These cute little darlings at Walmart. They look like they come from home good. These cute little mushrooms that I'm going to put out on my patio. I just keep finding little things for the patio. I have a mosquito net that I ordered from Amazon and a couple of more things that I'm going to put out on the patio. Of course, um, you know, I'm, I've already kind of constructed the way I want my patio this year, but I'm always adding extra stuff. New mosquito net. I'm not going to put that up th uh, at this moment. Actually, I'm going to wait until the rainy season is over, and then I'll, sh I'll give you a sneak peek on how that turned out. 
and just some little random things that I'm doing around the house, like refreshing my mulch. these little racks this year to keep the neighbor's kids out of my yard. this little snippet. Have an awesome day.